In this video, we are go going to look at the ball and mill pulverizer. Pulverizers are usually used in thermal power plant to crush the coal from its original size to smaller size. Pulverizers are also known as crushers. I, this is a ball and mill pulverizer. So this diagram belongs to ball and mill pulverizer. Here, the coals, the coal are crushed in between these two gaps. I first uh, explain the structure of this pulverizer, this ball and mill pulverizer. This ball and mill pulverizer consists of a feed input for entering the new raw coal into the pulverizer. This funnel is used to uh, uh, feed the raw coal into the pulverizer. After that, the raw coal is moved to this portion, that is the portion in between the races. Here, this entire this entire thing is known as stationary upper race. It is originally in the cylindrical form and this is a lower uh, race. It is also in the cylindrical form. So the upper race is stationary and the lower race is rotated by uh, the bevel gear. The bevel gear is, uh, is connected to the uh, motor coupled to the motor so that the rotation creates the motion. So in between the stationary race, upper race and uh, rotating lower race, a ball, a metal ball is uh, placed. This metal ball due to its relative velocity between these races, there, there is a crushing action or there is a uh, there is an action which just crushes the coal. So the crushed coal, in the coal is crushed in this portion. After the crushing of the coal, the coal, the powdered coal is taken to the rotating classifier. This rotating classifier works on the principle of centrifugal force, where the uh, larger larger coal particles are separated at its ends due to its larger mass uh, this rotating classifier due to the central centrifugal force the larger particles are uh, moves to the end due to in the rotation in rotation due to its centrifugal action the larger coals are uh, moved to the uh, end of this classifier and the powdered coal are at the center of the classifier so that the powdered coal are transferred to uh, to the boiler through this fine discharge through this fine discharge so here uh, the springs are kept to for the stability of this pulverizer this is how the ball and mill pulverizer is working so thank you friends